Hi, I'm artist Tony Thomas, and I want you to check out this week's new art release. I call it Good Old Days. So a while back, Phyllis and I uh, traveled to Independence, Kansas, and she participated in a waterfowl derby with Hunters with Mission, and I grabbed my easels and paints and decided to do some plein air painting. While driving down a county road, I discovered this old barn. So I literally parked our car on the side of the road, set up my easel, got all my paints out, and I began painting this worn down, tired looking barn. I just had to paint it. There's something special about an old barn that stands the test of time. I thought this is an interesting subject to paint, but I found out later from our friends in Kansas that this old barn was once a popular venue for barn dances in the late 1920s. Look at this advertisement. Barn Dance, Montgomery County, Kansas, has an 80 foot long dance floor. It's the perfect place for people to come together and enjoy music and dance. And the barn had a massive parking space of 80 acres and an additional 100 acre landing field, which made it popular, a popular destination for guests who flew in from afar to attend the dances. The Haymo Trio uh, was the band and they played traditional square and round dancing tunes. I tell you what, if these walls could talk, I had no idea about the exciting history. Despite the passing years and the weathering uh, of, of storms and seasons, this barn remains steadfast and unyielding. It's almost as if it has a stubbornness of its own, refusing to give up and fall like so many others have. Perhaps it's the memories of the barn dances and the festivals that once took place within its walls. Whatever the reason, this old barn is a symbol of resilience and endurance that continues to inspire. This is the original painting from that plein air experience. I called up my friends in Kansas and I asked them, hey, do you think it'd be possible to get some wood from that barn? I'd love to build a frame for it. And here it is. And I just love the, how this barn wood shows off the original paint now faded. So this is the original, and you can pick it up at TonyThomasArt.com. You can also get uh, prints, canvas wraps, and framed prints of this painting right here. Today, the old barn may be quiet, but its history lives on, and it remains a cherished part of the community's cultural heritage, a silent reminder of the good old days in era gone by. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.